Hello everybody, this is Tech Cut. In this video, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to try to install Windows 95 in VirtualBox on this Linux Mint operating system. Now the reason I'm doing this is because I'm looking for a little bit of a way back playback. I was just using my grandmother's old computer and had Windows 95 on it after I was uh, moving it forward and it was pretty cool to just kind of see the desktop. So that inspired me to see if I could load it up on here. Now I have an ISO of it, but if you want to do this yourself, you could either find an ISO or just search up Windows 95 on eBay. And then from here you either have the option to spend your life savings on it or just get a $10 copy somewhere. You could also find copies at like Goodwill or a smaller computer store that's more um, localized. So I'm going to give this a shot. I haven't done this yet, so I'm not sure exactly if it would work. So let's go Windows 95. Okay. I'm just going to kind of go with the recommended 64 megabytes. You know what? I'm going to go a little overkill. I'm going to double the power of this machine to 128 megabytes. So this is going to be a beast of a computer for if it were to come out. Let's curate. Let's go like that. Uh, dynamic is fine. 2 gigs is probably more than enough. And. I know that I'm not going to be able to select it this way. I'm pretty sure I'm not because it's a um, it's a floppy drive. Well, it's multiple floppy drives. The original uh, Windows disk came with numerous floppy drives, and you had to take them out, put them in, because it was only a couple megabytes each. And this um, the entire size of the operating system is a staggering like 20 megabytes so it took quite a bit of floppy drives to install it so I'm gonna go about this a different way I'm gonna go into settings storage uh, floppy controller um, let's get rid of the empty add a new choose the disk and we're in here already cool so yeah if I go to my downloads 95 and this is all the floppy drives so see they're all 1.6 megabytes so that's about the size and there's one two three there's 13 of them so 13 different floppy drives is what it took that would have been a pain in the ass so I'm assuming I could just use this install one right here alright let's go OK and see if this boots up right it's the only drive so it should boot right into it yes it's a starting with yes yes okay so hopefully this works okay we're gonna hit enter uh, that's fine. Oh shit, it's gonna restart. Okay, starting Windows 95. All right, formatting drive C. Man, it's gonna be so cool <laughs> if this actually works. Um, insert the following drive. So let's just go. Oh shit. Okay, disk drive A. Set up disk one to CD-ROM. If you're ready to continue, press Enter. Shit. So I'm gonna have to go to. Uh, how would I do this? I haven't used this to do it this way before. So input, view, machine, uh, devices, uh, floppy drives. Um, choose disk image. Let's go disk image one. Open. Then continue. Yes. Okay. Oh my god, yay. Okay, continue. Uh, oh, shit. Oh, it's not going to let me. Okay, machine. Does not support. Okay, that's fine. So let's capture. Yay! Continue. Okay, now insert disk 2. Uh, maybe it was. Aha, yeah, it's the control on the right side. So, oh man, this is going to take a while. I'm probably going to make you guys not have to watch this entire thing but let's see if the second one works don't show this message again yes yeah, see I probably should have just paid attention when it said that All right. okay sweet it works windows that's what I want the typical ooh set that are used for portable computers that's funny uh, recommended for most computers. That's cool. Uh, system administrators 
Should we go into custom? Let's go into custom. Screw it. Uh, set up. Is it has already been set up to use Windows? That's fine. Continue. Name. <laughs> Company McDonald. <laughs> what the hell? Whoever made this ISO is a comedian. Let's go tech hut. Oh, it's not going to work. Does it let, not let me type? Oh, no. Oh, well. I'll just go with that then. Uh, probably. <laughs> uh, da -da. Let's do that. Actually, let's go back. I, I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself here. Let's just let it do what it's got to do. Oh, it's all the same fucking settings. Whatever. Let's make sure all those work. Alright, so now it says get connected. Welcome to Windows email, fax, tools, and other online services. Would you like to install any of these components? Offers ooh, the Microsoft Network offers you access to email, headline news, internet bulletin boards, chat, and more. May require a modem. Wow, let's get that. And I'm pretty sure I am it connects you to Microsoft Mail Service and Post Offices. <laughs> In fact, okay. Install the common components. Yes, I want to start up disk. All right. Insert the next disk. I need to keep track of what freaking drive I'm on. So devices floppy. Okay, I could just do it that way. So let's choose disk three. Man, this is gonna take a while. Go in here and hit OK. Contains one. Okay. 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 Insert. Oh, God damn it. Okay, let's try this again. Devices, floppy drives. Maybe it's the install one. Go back in here. Okay. Aha! Alright, please insert the disk 95 of 2 and hit enter. Oh man, this is going to take me a minute. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Cancel. No, no, don't quit the setup. Okay. Devices, floppy drives. I said disk 2, right? Okay, let's try that again. Okay, now let's do three. All right, so this might go by a little quicker now. Three. Okay. Nice. Okay, so I'm probably just going to keep doing this over and over again, so I'm going to uh, cut the video and skip it. If any other dialogues or anything comes up, I'll definitely uh, show you guys. Alright, I'm almost done and I've got to do disk 12. That actually did not take long at all. So let's go through this together. The last two here. So disk 12, install that. Uh, devices, floppy disks, disk image 13. Boom and boom! Setup is now restart your computer. Alright, I will do that. Setup has detected floppy disk drive. Please remove all the disks from the computer. So I will do that now by going to devices, floppy drive. I'm going to uncheck that, make sure it actually unchecked it. Okay, so supposedly I have all the drives removed. I'm going to hit OK and see what happens. Dun 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 dun. Starting Windows 95. No! You need to restart your computer. Oh no. Was this a failed attempt? Uh, let's go like this. Power the machine down. Let's fire her up and see if it works. Let's see, starting Windows 95. Oh yes. Okay. So let's just let's just go with the normal. Oh my god. 
Ah, oh, god damn it. Okay, let's start this up in safe mode. It's getting closer. It's getting closer. So start. Dun dun dun. Starting Windows 95. Let's do that shit in safe mode. Oh my god. Uh, cannot detect. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, yes. This is Windows 95 in its purest form. Wow, okay. Let's see if I can make the uh, screen any bigger for us. Oh, here we go. Oh, it won't let me. I remember playing around in all these settings. Oh well. Uh, background. And look at all these old backgrounds. That's so funny. Pattern. Bricks. Oh my god, I remember all of this. Okay, let's go in here. Let's open up programs, startup, nothing. Documents, nothing. Settings, nothing. Okay. Let's restart this fucker. Oh man. Okay. Look at the recycle bin. There is, it's like none of the sidebars or anything. My computer. Oh, wowzers. Control panel. Wow. Okay, yeah, this was the display I was just in. I can make the size bigger. Change display type. Yeah, that's all it's going to get. That's fine. Oh, I love it, though. Ooh, actually, here we go. Standard. Let's go with the laptop display. Okay. Close. Oh, that didn't work. That's fine, though. Dun, dun, dun. Monitor is any star compliant. Okay, well, that's how you get it in there. I'm having to start it up in safe mode, but it's still really cool that I could get in here. Let's see what fonts they got going on. Not very many. Wingding. Oh, ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, I remember this. It's so awesome. Okay, well, thank you for watching. This was more of a kind of a fun video. Uh, please comment, rate, and subscribe. Uh, I'll be uploading a lot more videos soon. So, expect that from me. And I hope you all have a good day. And... Just just have fun, have a good day. All right, bye.